Hey, I'll open carry NH here, uh, heading out for, I think, the first open carry litter cleanup in New Hampshire for 2010. It's over in Durham, New Hampshire right now, We're right near UNH. Um, hopefully we'll have a fairly good crowd. Last time I saw there was about 10 to 15 people who said they'd be there, I think. Um, should be a pretty nice day. It's 55 degrees out here near Manchester. <laughs> Uh, it's at 1 p.m. Today is Sunday, March, I think, 7th, or is, yeah, 7th. We're in Durham with Alex, who organized this event here. Uh, what made you organize this event today? Well, um, I'm one of the students, along with Nick, with Young Americans for Liberty, and uh, we figured there was war about, was it two months ago, when the, there was a guy on campus seen carrying a gun, and he was, he was detained, and uh, he was found out to not be a threat. They had a whole campus alert going out, and they made a big deal about it. So we just want to try to put the message out there that you shouldn't be afraid of peaceful people uh, doing community service, picking up trash armed with guns. You should be more afraid of masked cops and body armor. Now, do you carry openly on a regular basis? Uh, I do, uh, but ne never in Durham. Never in Durham? Have you uh, ever been stopped by the police in any town? Uh, I've never actually been stopped before. I've had a lot of cops like, stay in the area and kind of shout at me, but I've never actually been stopped. What towns? Uh, Dover, Dover, Concord. Cool. I've been stopped by Concord PD, I think, six or seven times now. I had a cop freak out when he pulled me over once. I'm like, hey, I have my permit here, but my oh. pistol's in my glove box. And he like, I... puts his hand on his pistol. And he's I didn't like, even tell him. Move slow. Move <laughs> slow. Cool. Here, we started picking up some trash here. Definitely a lot of trash in this area. Don't think we'll clean everything, but we'll get quite a bit cleaner than it is when we walk down the road. We've kind of walked around a bit, and so far no one stopped us. We have a couple of people kind of ogle their eyes at us, and um, somebody from Connecticut yelled something out the window, we think, but we're not sure. We didn't really hear them. It's usually kind of hard to hear them coming from their car, uh, but there's definitely a lot of people out here. We've uh, finished one bag of trash, uh, the three of us, and we're going to head back, maybe do one more bag of trash. At this point, we'll see how things go. Saw a little more trash, so. Somebody screaming oh, out the window. Uh, in any case, we're about back to the coffee shop where our base is and grab another bag and head out again. Well, that was kind of fun. We threw three bags for, I think, five of us, two of us left quite early. Uh, heading back to my car now. I'm gonna head up to Concord and walk around there a bit. Um, so, see you in a bit in Concord. Alright, I'm here in Concord. We'll be doing a usual walk around here, see how things go. Um, it's a very nice day, still pretty sunny, and according to the car, it's almost 60 degrees. That's a uh, March high, I think, maybe, for New Hampshire? <laughs> Probably not, I don't know. Um, so much for global warming. Um, I think last year, I guess it was in the 60s in December, so that's when I first was stopped in Concord. I haven't been wandering around here, so we'll see if they remember me or if they have new officers on the beat or if the same officers are here, and maybe I'll get stopped by uh, Officer, I think it was Fallon. Uh, see if I can get a third stop by him. Anyway, I'll be uh, parking and wandering around shortly. Enjoy.